Hello. Today my today my father, Aaron Pouncy, stringed his help on a nettle. And then we were quite interested. We thought about looking deeply into a nettle. So if we come over here to the mic to these lovely microscope um it has a nettle leaf on it that my father removed from the nettle plant and so we placed it on here um the magnifying glass from this nettle over by this pond And so we put it here and we thought about what would it look like. So we focused it and looked through. What are they about to see? Well. Sorry, could you just slightly move out of the light? And then now maybe move over here more. Thank you. And um, if you could continue explaining what they're going to see while I focus on it. Okay. Well, first you shall see the tip of the of one of the look like hairs of the leaf. But as you do look, it is there are no leaf. There are no hairs on a nettle. Instead. Hundreds of little spikes, and all those spikes are hollow. And first, you shall see the very tip of the spikes, which which will be white and will also look quite sharp. And and that white is filled with the poison. And there's a little, and it looks like a tiny thin vein running down, which is another part of the, of the poison. And as you look down, you'll see how it connects. Yes, I'm sorry, I'm just slightly struggling with, what, I'm slightly struggling with being able to, ah, now I might have it there. And well, that and well, of course, the poison is white. What colour spots come up when you get stung by a nettle? White spots. That's a great I theory. I suggest that that is the poison rising and also don't be afraid to get stung by a nettle, just never try to. Po the poison will not kill a human being, but I suppose if it was a tiny creature, it would probably kill that. So don't worry, just don't ever go near one. And if you do, usually dock, dock leaves actually grow near nettles, and the dock leaf is the cure for nettle stings. So always grab a dock leaf after being stung and rub it on the sting. That will make it go away. Uh, I have really enjoyed this video. Thank you very much. You're I actually managed to get some okay footage of this as well, so we'll be able to, you can see it does sort of film a bit. So yeah, hopefully it'll be interesting to watch as well with the, the, magnif with the microscope. Thank you very much, Annie Pouncey. You're welcome.